What's going on guys, Dr. Dave here coming back at you guys with another video. Uh, in today's video we're going to talk a little bit about the leaked skins that have been released for season 6. Uh, we saw some earlier with the pilots and now we've got some Halloween skins that have been coming out. Um, I'm also going to talk a little bit about the Bright Bomber and what's going on with her and uh, my theory on the Blockbuster skin. So, um, in the background what you'll see is a solo game that I played on stream the other day. I stream basically every day, so if you guys want to check me out, uh, follow the stream, just come in and hang out or say hi, what's up, I'll be pretty awesome. Um, you can just, I play with followers every day and I probably play with my viewers too, so if you guys want to just stop by, the link will be in the description. So let's go ahead and dive right into this video. So in this video we're going to see the two skins that I've been released for the Halloween one. Uh, you're going to see the male skin, uh, who's called Heyman, and the female skin, which is Straw Ops. Um, you'll see their glider, which is a scarecrow, which looks pretty sick. They're all going to be epic, um, and they have a really nice pickaxe, which is like, um, almost looks like a scythe. Uh, but it's not really the scythe, which I really like because I didn't get to use the Skull Trooper. So, um, or I didn't get to play during the time Skull Trooper was, was when, when it came out. I did have the option, but I decided to play PUBG instead. I was a pleb, so... Here I am, gonna try to get this scythe, I think it's pretty awesome, and it looks really dope. Um, and then, in regards to the Bright Bomber, so this, if you look at this picture right here, you'll see that she's touching the cube, and in the reflection you can see that her corrupted form of it. Now, with the cube when it was on the map in Season 5, uh, everywhere it went, it left these corrupted areas on the map. And you can even see in the challenges, it tells you to visit corrupted areas. So, if you notice that uh, with these corrupted areas, um, where it has all these different cubes and things like that, my theory is that all these other skins that are going to be coming out, well, many of the other skins that are going to be coming out, are going to have different renditions of skins that are already out currently, but a dark form of them, like a corrupted form. So maybe the knights will come back, a few of the knights, like the uh, Black Knight, which was only a Battle Pass skin, so anyone who didn't get to play that time can't get it. Maybe you will come out again as a corrupted form or a dark, um, a dark form of it. Um, which this part leads into my blockbuster theory. So if you look at the blockbuster skin right here, you'll see well the the image of, it, of the skin. You'll see that it has a very like smooth and round head. No other skin in the game has that besides one, and we already knew that this skin was coming back in the first place, and that's Skull Trooper. Um, but in my opinion, Skull Troopers. Too much, too good of a skin to, to just bring back. They'll make a bunch of money off of it. Obviously, it's the most um, sought-after skin in the game, but it almost isn't really fair to the people who had it prior to um, how big Fortnite has been now. Yes, it was a big game, but it wasn't near as big as it is now. So my theory is that they're going to bring a dark form of the skin out. So maybe the Dark Skull Trooper, and it honestly looks like that could be the case. It's just going to be a little bit different, and it's probably going to be like the, the boss of Season 6, the Blockbuster skin. So that was honestly my theories on what's going on right now. If you enjoyed the video, leave a like, leave a comment down below. Don't forget to check me out on the stream, and I'll see you guys next time.